lot of it will be a force to be reckoned with here at the Iron Curve. Antonio Arevalo is a man whose life revolves around speed. Let's have a look at the young Spaniard. Laszlo Kalanovic, yellow shirt from Hungary. His opponent in purple is the extremely talented, extremely fast young Spanish athlete Jose Antonio Arevalo. Power would favor the Hungarian. Speed would certainly favor the man from Spain. Arevalo in purple. Watch for the speed. Watch for the power from Kolonovic. If Kolonovic can get this anywhere near the inside and manage to connect with his wrist and hand, it should be an easy evening for him. But uh, you can see straight away the young Spanish athlete hammers into his hand, slips apart. Both men top roll. Neither is strong enough to hold the other's hand, and we go into the strap match. A one inch nylon strap placed around the wrists, around the hands. Richard Poole, the referee, will tighten that as tight as possible. Palm to palm, nowhere to go. The, the guys cannot slip apart on this occasion. And we will get a result from this match. And Kalanovic has a superb position on the setup. The lower palm of Laszlo Kalanovic, you can see in shot there how far forward the lower palm of the Hungarian in the yellow shirt actually is. That will give him massive leverage. He still needs to deal with the speed from the Spanish athlete. Oh, look at that from... Oh, that's a tremendous hit, and Laszlo Kalarovic can't believe it. Jose Antonio Arevalo, you know the speed's coming, but uh, stopping it's a different matter. Slip again, straps will be applied. Arevalo really is a bullet. He's very, very quick out of the blocks, and not only is he fast, but he's very smooth. He's not a ragged athlete, doesn't hit in all kinds of directions, extremely focused. That hit comes fast and it comes over a very clearly defined area, a very small area. And trying to counter it is not easy. A little smile breaks on the face of the Spanish athlete. Looking at the area of uh, Kalarovic's hand he wants to hit, and it'll be a different Laszlo this occasion, believe me. He'll change his grip, he'll change the, the area where the power is applied with the sole purpose of trying to take away the speed of the Spanish athlete. for the power from Laszlo Kalarovic. That's the man in the yellow shirt, former Nemirov World Cup runner-up, Hungarian national champion. A list of accolades as long as his arm, and his arm is pretty long for a 70 kilogram athlete. Very large hand. He's the bigger, more powerful of the two. The strap will favor him if he can contain that initial burst from the Spaniard. Jose Antonio Arevalo looks clearly unsettled on this second start. Unable to get comfortable, needs to be comfortable to apply his speed. Kalanovic with the hit, drives down, it's 1-1. Hungary taking it. What a drive there, Laszlo Kalanovic powers down in the strap, takes the pin. And that will make him feel a lot better. The focus comes on from the Hungarian, closes his eyes, feeling the match. Oh, that's a great hit. He literally countered the speed. Watch for the hit. There it is. Kolarovic dives down, completely sucked Aravalo into the hook. The experience of Kolarovic counting double there, and he takes that pin. That's a huge hit again. Moves to the tricep press, can't finish. The slip will go to the straps. And Kalanovic showing he's got some speed of his own. 
and I think he, he will be very happy that these matches are going to strap because that gives him an excellent opportunity to use all his power, all his leverage advantage at the table and to take away some of the speed of the Spanish athlete. Jose started well with a massive attack, took the first pin, but is unable, unable to repeat it in the last two, and he trails in this match. A little better on that occasion, but again, the power of Kalanovic is evident. Huge hit again from Jose Antonio Arevalo, but Kalanovic with the lap drag. And Laszlo Kalanovic is taking over now goes to three pins and he'll relax now knows he can't lose the arm wrestling match he'll want to make it count double though and go through with these last couple of pins Richard Poole centers the athletes up watch for the big hit from the Spanish athlete there it is this time he manages to get out of the hand and we go to the straps again Laszlo Kalanovic then the yellow shirt He's a man with huge experience and uh, needing no introduction anywhere in the world of arm wrestling. He's a guy, he's a serious competitor for anybody to overcome at the 70 kilo weight class. Pretty good. There's a better hit. And this time the Spanish athlete can stop the hit and manages to get some power into the hand and wrist of Kalanovic. Kalanovic with the drive, but he stopped. And the leverage of the Spaniard is coming into play now. Guts the back pressure, there's the hit. Tries to readjust, sets, hits again, hits again. Unsettling, Laszlo, and oh, very close on that occasion. This is much better from Jose Antonio Arevalo, and there's the pin, and that was an excellent performance. Look initially, the huge hit, then he rests and applies the back pressure. Now, at this point, Kalanovic is thinking he's still got the power, but there he goes to try to take it, and unable to do so, and suddenly it's a look of distress and despair that comes on his face because he realises, oh, dear, I'm into something here, and as he's readjusting, the Spanish athlete is hitting away on him, unseating and unsettling him, readjusts, drives down, Antonio Revelo is back in the arm wrestling match, 3-2. Spain are still alive. The hopes of Spain rest with that young man, Jose Antonio Arevalo. Arevalo trying to drive back. He gets into the hand. Oh, and we will go into the strap match. Kalanovic couldn't control the hand of the Spanish athlete. Straps will be applied. Now then, are we going to see the same soup warmed over from... Jose Antonio Arevalo. Can he repeat the performance and level this match 3 3? Arevalo, back pressure, there it is, and he has done. He's opened the wrist and hand of Kalanovic. Now those attacks, and he drives down, drives down, rests, collects himself, looks to attack again. There it goes, there it goes, and that time so close. Whoa, very, very close to the pin. Surely a pin. That looked like a pin to me, but it's not being given. And uh, Kalanovic sets himself with a tricep. Richard Poole almost called that a pin. It will not get any closer than that. Jose Antonio Arevalo driving down, but look at Kalanovic now, sneaking around with the tricep. The guys find time to play mind games. It's Kalanovic with the reversal. Oh, Laszlo Kalanovic with the reversing top roll. Laszlo Kalanovic with